here I am in the morning. This is what I look like in the morning. Yeah. So we're going to go through his toy box and we're going to see what he's got. First of all, we got some toys sprawled across the room. We just cleaned his bed so it's nice and clean for him. So this is actually one of his first toys right here. And he absolutely loves this toy. Don't you, baby? All right. He got this one, his lamb chop. He loves his lamb chop. I'm always having to wash his damn toys because he's always taking them outside. Aren't you? Yeah. He got this one from his Aunt Teresa. He loves that one. He doesn't take that one outside yet. The neighbor's dogs just came out. He got this one for Christmas. I actually wasn't going to buy it, but Valentine toys were already out. And I was like, oh, it's cute. All right. We all know this one here. This is one of the ones that came in those little uh, stocking stuffers for the doggies. All right. Let's check out what's in this toy box. This is a cedar chest here. All right. Look, we got a picture of his girlfriend up there. Adorable. This one's about ready to be retired. Because the ducky, believe it or not, when I got Diesel, this ducky was his second or third stuffed animal. And he was so much smaller than this little guy. And he used to drag this stuffed animal around. Let's see what else we got in here. Oh, here's another one he stuck outside. We got thrown in the washing machine. But uh, it looks like he's starting to tear up the leg. This poor little unicorn. Oh. Oh, here's another one that's been outside. Now, I can tell you, we have ducks. And he loves to play with the ducks outside. I think he's crazy. But you know what? That's what he loves. What are you doing, baby? We're over here going through your toy box. Don't you want to be over here? All right. He loves toys that has like uh, big ears, big noses. Because uh, he likes to drag them around by the ears and the noses. So that's something that I've learned to trend when I'm purchasing him a toy. All right. Here's another one. This one came from Aunt Teresa again. But like I said, he loves when they have... Uh, he likes to grab them by, like I said, the, the noses and the ears and... He just loves it. I'm shocked this one still has a bow on it, to be honest. I figured he would have tore the bow up already. Look at this. We got a pile going on here. All right, now we're getting down to the, the gritty here. Okay. Oh, look. Here's his hat for winter. He wears this hat. It is so cute when he puts it on. Let's put it up here. There we go. Alright, so these are some of those first toys he ever liked. Like I said, long arms, nose. Looks like I'm going to be doing some washing today. Whoa! Look at this. All these little ones actually go into this little toy box here. This is his first toy box he ever got. Right here. Believe it or not, that's... Well, hello there. Oh, he's leaving me again. All right, this is another one he loves. Man, we really need to do stuff in the washing machine. This one he did. Oh, Lord, look, you guys. That one's going in the trash. He tore that one all up. Man. What else we... Oh, his hippo. Jeez, he used to love his hippo. Well, that one's empty now. Okay, so these are one of the ones that came into those stocking stuffers. And when they went, yes, honey, how can I help you? What, baby? We're going through your toy box. You're not going outside because you like to play in the mud pit. And mommy just gave you a bath yesterday. You know, he was nasty yesterday. I didn't catch him in the mud pit, but he was in there, weren't you, baby? He likes to get in where the piggies are. And he likes to roll around in the pig dirt. Could you guys imagine the smell? Yeah, it was pretty raunchy. So here we are at the bottom of this toy box. Oh, Lord, we got to wash that one. Here's another one. Looks like we're going to be doing a little laundry today. 
You know, I guess I didn't realize. Oh, there's another one. He loves this one. He loves it because of the long neck. When he was a baby, I think it was like six months old, he was dragging this thing around by the neck. All over the house. This is one of his other favorite ones. He hasn't torn it up yet. I'm shocked. Ooh, this one's pretty uh, nasty. You guys go through your doggy toy box? Well, he loves these little ones. I bought him a really big one. I don't know where it is. It's probably outside. But he really likes it. At first, he never chewed on them. And then he really got into them. Look, more Christmas ones. You know, when you get those Christmas stockings, they go 75% off. You got to snake them up. Oh, look at this toy. I got one somewhere that you put peanut butter in it. These, he'll tear up in a second. I said, I'm never buying him any more of these. These came in the stocking stuffers. Oh, his cappuccino. <laughs> I really did buy a lot of those uh, stocking stuffers. Dang, Diesel. Oh, check this one out. Sorry, baby. <laughs> oh, look. It's a... I don't think it's a pile of poop. I don't know what it is. Up, oh, there's another one. All right. It wasn't outside. This one had a heart and a, a rope on it. Don't know where it is. Up, oh, now we got a pile of poop. Oh, I got to put a new bottle in here. This one's kind of neat because you put an actual bottle in here. So after it gets chewed up so much, I'm trying to open one-handed. After it gets chewed up so much, you can literally put a new bottle. I can't open it for the life of me. Come on. See, you just literally put a new bottle. So it's kind of neat. They like the sound of it. There you go. There we go. So we got to put a new bottle in there. So let's put it over here on the side. Oh, there's another one he likes. He got this one from his Aunt Teresa too. I think he did. Can't remember for sure. So many people buy him toys. They'll be like, oh, I found something at the store. Oh, yeah, the Easter. Look at that one. Oh, gosh. We got to wash this one. That one looks like it's, yeah, what I'm going to discuss that one. Oh, Halloween. Nah, nah, nah. We almost done. Oh, yeah, we're almost done. <laughs> like I said, like he really needs more toys, right? Let's see what he's got in here. All these go into, oh, there it is. He put peanut butter in this. He's almost got all the peanut butter done. Baby, you're not going outside. No. No, you're not going outside. I'm sorry. You're not going outside. Not right now, baby. Okay. So, there is... Oh, look. It's another chew toy. I try to put... Not chew toy. I try to put his bones over here. So, that way he has his bones separate. And then I put all his small toys in here. But as we can see, oh, oh, and here we go. That's all his toys. This one's about ready to be thrown away. So there's all his toys that he's got. Oh, that's part of the I Love New York. Oh, so let me get up and show you. Oh, this crazy mess. Yeah, these are all your toys, baby. All your toys. Sometimes when I come home from work, guess what? The toy box is empty and the toys are everywhere. So there's my baby's toys. So you guys have a great day and I will talk to you later. Right, baby? Say bye. Getting these in here. We're going to wash them up. And I just want to let you guys know, 
Diesel has about 100 feet to play outside in a fenced in area. So when I say he can't go outside, he can't go out front. I don't want y'all thinking he don't have, you know, a way of going outside when he wants because he can. He's got about 100 feet to play in. And trust me, he has a field day out there. It's fenced in, part of it's privacy fenced. Um, sometimes my dad will come over and let him out the back fence. So, and he's able to come and go as he pleases. So, when I say he can't go outside, it's only out front to run through the whole 15 acres. So, that's what it is. All right, we're going to wash these toys.